From bases that are located on the top of the world to ones buried deep inside the mountains, I'm Bob from World 5 List. Join me as I reveal eight top secret military locations you probably don't know about. Number 8. Harp, Gakona, Alaska Near the top of the world is a very mysterious military location, specifically Gakona, Alaska, where the HARP facility is located. This facility was built during the Reagan era of the United States as part of his Star Wars program, and HARP stands for High Frequency Active Auroral Research Program. Now, what they do there is shoot beams of energy, sound, and other things into the lonosphere and get readings back on what exactly happens. It's also a place where you can observe the aurora borealis, which no doubt gets researched as well. So why is this a top secret military location? Well, because a lot of people either don't like what they're doing, as they feel they're screwing with the environment or they don't believe that their actual goals are what they say they are. You see, HARP is defined as a scientific outpost, which given the description I made above seems logical. However, there are those who believe that their testing of the lonosphere is just a cover up for more military-minded experiments and tests, including climate engineering. Now, the thing about it is, people accuse them of controlling the weather, or at least trying to, in order to create a massive super weapon. Storms and tornadoes can be very powerful tools, especially if you can harness their power to fall on certain parts of the world. So to that end, this has made Harp the subject of many conspiracy theories, including, you guessed it, alien contact. Number 7 the Yulin Naval Base in China. One of the reasons that secret military locations are able to remain secret for so long is simply because nobody can see everything. Just think about it. Recon craft can only go so far without being spotted, right? Well, with the arrival of satellite imagery, everything changed, and that would force the Chinese to reveal their Yulin Naval Base. Now, to be fair, they did hold out for some time and weren't exposed until 2008, which is a long time to have a secret naval base depending on when you believe it was constructed. As for what the purpose of the base is, it's to harbor some of their nuclear submarines. Even more, because of its position just off of Hainan Island, it gives them the perfect position to attack anyone who comes into the sea in the area of Southeast Asia. The island has caverns that can hide most ships, keeping them off of radar, but when they want to go loud, they have ballistic missiles on the shore, not included what they have in the submarines themselves, and to top it all off, they even have aircraft carriers stationed there to fend off attacks. Now, I'm pretty sure that you can see now why they wanted to keep it out of people's eyesight, but now that we know it's there, it might actually get even more terrifying. Number 6. The Denver International Airport But first, be sure to subscribe if you're new here, and for those returning subscribers, welcome back! I'm happy to see you, and happy to bring you another awesome video. Now, you may be asking yourself, what's an airport doing on a list that's dedicated to secret military bases? Well, as the old saying goes, you can't judge a book by its cover. And trust me, you'll want to read the pages of this book. Denver International Airport is by and large one of the strangest places in the United States, full of conspiracy theories about what its true intentions are. But the biggest ones, that actually feel credible, is that the whole place is a cover-up for a series of tunnels and bases that are built beneath the airport. Now on the surface, <laughs> that may sound crazy, but it may not be as crazy as you think. You see, if you look at the layout of the Denver International Airport, you're going to immediately notice that something's a little wrong. Its layout and design is unlike any other airport out there. It's not even streamlined and doesn't guide people to where they need to go, and many who go there note that it's disorienting. Adding to all of this, the original plans for the airport were scrapped for what we have now, which makes you wonder what the original plans were. Further adding to the strangeness of the place is the art on the walls, 
This art has been well talked about in the media, and many wonder what its true meaning is. However, many interpret it to mean that if the worst should happen, there's safety underground, meaning the secret tunnels and bases that are hidden beneath. The construction costs for the place have gone up from 1.7 billion, with a B, to 5 billion. Now, what could need that much maintenance? Secondly, Denver is located near the middle of the United States, making it a prime location to bunker down should the worst come to pass. Number 5. The Dugway Proving Grounds in Utah This facility was put in place two months after the attack on Pearl Harbor in 1941. Ever since then, it's been the home to a lot of weapons testing and other tests that have raised the eyebrows of those who find out about it. Now, it should be noted that the Dugway Proving Grounds are massive, in fact, bigger than Rhode Island. Not by much, but still, that's good for its size and scale. So what does the military need with such a large testing facility? Well, in order to test such things, you need a space big enough to make sure you're not going to bring harm to anyone. And the Dugway Proving Grounds has that in spades and droves, and because of that, it's tested weapons, aircraft, and a whole lot of others. Now, this isn't just speculation. There are documented reports that say that certain things have been tested on the grounds. And the funny thing is, there's also a 48,000 square foot building called the Reginald Kendall Combined Chemical Test Facility, where, you guessed it, chemical weapons are tested. Now, to what extent though, nobody knows, but it does give pause. Number 4. NORAD, the Cheyenne Mountain Complex Now we head to the mountains to talk about a well-respected but relatively secret military base known as NORAD. Their main purpose is to track all flight in North American airspace, which is a big deal when you think about it. That's three major countries worth of airplanes that are all going all over the place, and they have to keep track of them. It's not a small job. Add to that, they also keep track of what's going on in outer space. It's not just NASA doing that. NORAD does it as well. So you might feel that NORAD would be a highly guarded base somewhere on the surface, right? Well, it's actually in the Cheyenne Mountain Complex, specifically inside of a hollowed out mountain near Colorado Springs. Can you imagine how long it took to hollow out that mountain? I mean, seriously. And not unlike what's speculated about the Denver International Airport, NORAD has been built to withstand nuclear disaster. There are 800 people working there, and all of them could live in the base safe and sound for about a month without any fear of being bombed, caved in, or breached. Talk about workplace safety. Number 3. Site R, Raven Rock, Pennsylvania In this age of modern technology and weaponry, not to mention tension between countries of the world, you know that there are secret locations where the leader should go if World War III should break out. For the United States, that's Site R, also called Raven Rock Command Center. It's located in Pennsylvania, and the site is meant to be protected from just about anything, including nuclear weaponry. There's even reports that there's a six-mile tunnel underneath the base connecting to Camp David, the retreat of the president. Another more interesting fact is that GPS and cell phones don't work there, meaning that any attempts to signal to someone about what's going on is going to be extremely hard to do, and makes it harder to attack in unison. It also means there's a dedicated system within the site that's going to allow the president and the generals to communicate to the outside world and command forces. Personally, I hope that this site never has to be put into use. Number 2. The Military Science Park in England Now, there's an airfield, and the areas that surround the airfield are one such place. The Boscombe Down Airfield has a danger area, no doubt trying to keep people from getting too close to what's actually going on. And what is actually going on? Well, it's the home of Kinetic, a research branch of the military that has gone private. Within its 7,000 acres of land, Kinetic gets to conduct all kinds of testing in a variety of fields, making it a versatile research company. 
They also work with a lot of branches of English government and are allowed to study chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear warfare. What exactly they come up with there is a bit of a mystery, but they must be getting results to continue doing whatever they're doing. Number 1. Area 51 Now of course you had to know that Area 51 would be number 1 on the list, and why wouldn't it be? The most top secret location on my list that nobody truly knows what's going on there, except those who know what's going on there. The ironic thing about Area 51 is that despite its secrecy in terms of intent, the military hasn't exactly hidden it. It is in Nevada, it is near Groom Lake, it's been shot in photos and revealed in satellites, there's no denying that, and there's no denying that the military acknowledges that. It's the other things that they deny. And to this day, many people believe that Area 51 isn't just operational, but houses the secrets that could blow the minds of people all over the world. You've heard the stories, but I'll recount a few of my favorites. Area 51 is the home of aliens that have crash-landed on our planet and have been experimented on by government. More so, the technology is being studied and reverse-engineered so that the U.S. can use it. Number two, it's the home of a shadow government that's actually controlling the world and they've even made contact with aliens and made a deal with them so that the earth won't be invaded and destroyed. And number three, it's a top secret weapons facility developing the next generation of warfare. And the stories and theories just go on and on and on. Thanks for watching! Have you ever heard of any of these military locations? Maybe you live near one and have witnessed some strange things. Let me know about it in the comments below. Be sure you're subscribed, and I'll see you next time on World 5.